Good morning, everybody. This is Avon, and we are back with our fifth episode of our Final Fantasy 1 Let's Play. Last time we left off, I kind of made an oopsie-daisy, traveled a little, a little further than I probably should have, and we ended up um, almost dying. Twice. So, that was fun. Uh, luckily, Katie was there with her. Well, I guess technically Katie and James were there with their healing spells. Most of the credit goes to her, though. I mean, you know, white mages are pretty good with healing spells, usually. <laughs> so yeah, we didn't get to get to the pirates last time, but we're going to do that now. Now that I've got us all the equipment that this area can provide, at least. Now let's see what we can get. Cannonballs of steel. Well, that's one way to get away from the sensors. <coughs> <coughs> This will be fun. <coughs> Dude, my bones aren't Wheaties. You can't make them go crunch. Let's slow them down a bit first. No, no. Let's see, before we even do that. Yeah, we can do that. Why not? <coughs> and we'll bash on one for good luck. <laughs> Missed all but one. Hmm. <clears throat> okay, so... You know, let's try putting him to sleep instead and see how that goes. <clears throat> okay. All unconscious except for two of them. That all do nicely. Oh, wow, these guys actually don't have as much damage on them as I thought they did. Okay. Well, I'll just go ahead and take out these last two, then. <laughs> Nine pirates gone like that. And we got paid a lot for it, too. <coughs> uh-huh. Of course you won't. <coughs> I don't know, this pirate just gave us our ship. What do you think? Should we forgive him? I mean, I certainly won't, but, you know. He gave us a ship, at least we got something out of it. Ha 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 I'm gonna run around town because I got a ship! I got a ship. Hey, mister! Hey, mister! Guess what? I got a ship and you don't. Hey, hey, you! I got a ship and you don't. Hey, hey, you! Lady! I got a ship. And you don't. <coughs> Whoa, hello. That was a really ugly glitch there. Did anyone else see that, or was that just me? Just me? Okay. So, that lady was talking about elves to the south. Or southwest-ish. Maybe that's where we'll go next. Yeah, you think so? That sounds like a good, a good plan, yeah. Yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll go ahead and head southwest. <coughs> hey, wait, there's a tall, there's a strange guy standing there. wonder if he's got something to say to us. Fled here from Melmond, a town far to the west. A truly pitiable sight. The earth rots and monsters attack in the night. There's nothing you can do to help. <coughs> hmm. We'll get to that guy later. Or get to his town later, at least. Before we do that, though, we gotta go all the way... I pressed the wrong button. We need to go all the way down here. <coughs> Hang on. Huh. How's... How do you... How? I don't know. We'll figure it out. Attack of the Wild Buccaneers. 
<coughs> Wonder how strong these guys are. Guess we'll find out. Reminds me, I should probably do some uh, background checks on them. <coughs> hmm. Bash him in the face. Bash him in the face. Bash, 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 bash him in the face. Bash, bash him? Well, there was four of them. I got 480 gil out of that. Okay, we should probably fight those guys a little more. Uh, werewolves. <coughs> oh, zombies, ghouls, garland. I <laughs> had a long sword. I wonder if we sold that. Ogre, ogre sheep, lizard. Pirates gave us leather shield. No, they didn't. Okay, so buccaneers drop sabers. They have resistance to quake, but that's about it. <clears throat> okay, well, we'll find more. Uh, or they'll find us. Quickly, children, let's set him on fire! <clears throat> Kill it with fire, Mina! Kill it with fire! Do it! Do it till he burns! Yes! That guy, like, had the worst luck in the entire world. He gets set on fire, and then <clears throat> he dies a painful death. I mean, just imagine that. You get set on fire, and then you get smashed in the face with a giant hammer. Worst luck ever. Oh. Looks like ours is about to change. <clears throat> And do some quick healing, and we're gonna freeze one of these guys out. Katie heal herself. This is what I like about having two mages on the party. It makes healing a little more uh, doable. You're not you're not having to worry as much if something should ever go wrong, and you end up like having you know if one of your healers goes down, you have another one on backup and standby. <coughs> Come on, ogre. Give us a break. Aw, we broke the ogres. I'd feel bad, but I don't. We found the elves! We found the elves! We found the elves! Looky, looky, we found the elves! We found all the elves. We found the elves, we found the elves. Ha 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 ha! I don't know what I'm so giddy about. Let's see. You see a gravestone? You see a gravestone? Okay, there's three of these, and you know what they say, three, third time's the charm. This one has a special flower under it, too, wonder. Here lies Link. No, that's, that's what it says. Huh. Well, then. Um. That's, uh, that, that's, that's kind of sad, really. I mean... No, that's what it says. Okay, here lies Link. I'm not. I'm not going blind. <clears throat> well then, uh, hmm. I don't know what to say to that. That's um. That's interesting. Just spells cost a thousand each. Are you freaking serious? <clears throat> but hey, at least we get our hands on a heal spell. Heal is nice. It actually restores. Doesn't restore as much as cure or anything. It's most, most kind of like a regular, a regular cure spell. But it restores it to the entire party, which isn't too bad. Cure would be nice to have as well. It restores more HP. Diara, I, we could use it to replace Dia, I suppose. <clears throat> and uh, Null Blaze would be nice. Okay, so we're basically going to give her Diara and Heal, and then we'll split it down the middle for Cura and, and Null Blaze. But before we do that, let's check out what the Black Magic spells see. <clears throat> oh, to hell with you! <clears throat> Fira Thundara. And of course, my Red Mage can equip all of these. Bastard. <sighs> okay. Fokara Thundara. Fokara lowers evasion of all foes. Did I even get any? Did anybody get focus? Did I put focus on anybody? No, I didn't. <coughs> I might have to do that. 
Fira deals fire damage to all foes. Of course, we're going to need that at some point. Hold paralyzes one foe. I've never been one for paralysis. Like, usually any of the spells that are just plain uh, debuffs rather than damage, I've never really been one for them because they never seem to work out quite the way you were hoping they would. Crozier. Staff topped with an iron ring. I'd like to see one of those one day. A saber. <laughs> we already have one of those. We don't need it. Okay, well, we'll go ahead and get a dagger for uh, Mina. She deserves one after all the work she's had to put in. Put in been, been, blah, blah. After all the work she's been doing, she kind of deserves to have a new weapon, you know? Besides, that knife looks a little puny anyway. I mean, really, it's a small knife, dude. Who wants a small knife? You want a big dagger or a bigger sword. And no, those are not penis jokes that I'm floating by your head. <coughs> Huh. Nope. Okay. Defense four. Everything's so expensive here. Alright, we'll get one leather cap and see how that goes. See, his evasion keeps going down. <clears throat> you know what? I wonder. Let's take gloves off of him. Nope, his evasion still goes down. Okay. I should have known. <clears throat> Copper armlet. You guys think we should get... Well, I guess we only have enough to get one, so there goes that idea. Okay, well, you know, we'll just get one. I think we can get another one at some other point in time. Oh, okay. Really, guys? Oh, I see. Instead of clothes. Oh, now it's all making sense. <gasps> oh my gosh, it actually works. However... I would like to grant them extra defense before myself. Just because it makes it makes sense that way, you know? Alright. <clears throat> so we've done that. Uh, we're about 13 minutes in. So we'll just... Oh, not that one. Uh, that leads outside. Is there anything over here? Besides this elf, no one knows where Astos, King of the Dark Elves, is gone. <coughs> I know where he is. He's very close. <coughs> He's watching you, in fact. Oh, we also have level 4 spells, which all cost over... Yeah, they cost 2,500. Can you believe that? Poisona, however, we will need that. Poisona, cures poison. Yes. <coughs> you know what? I don't think they've reached the ability to get... Yeah, see, so they haven't reached that magic level yet. So, okay, we'll have to wait for that, then. <clears throat> it's going to be hard with just one red mage deciding which kind of <clears throat> abilities we want to keep. No, no, not that one. <clears throat> How much does it cost for it? A hundred gil. Okay. <clears throat> well, at least we managed to beat pirates and cross the sea to the Land of Elves. So we're going to go ahead and stop off here in the next episode. Um, well, before this episode and the next one, what I'm going to do is... I'm just going <clears> to... <throat> between this episode and the next one, I should say. I'm going to do some grinding, get us all the spells we'll need, um, get some equipment. Well, I guess we, I guess we, all, we have all the equipment that we need. All equipment that we can afford, at least. Um, actually, yeah, we have pretty much all the equipment we can afford, so I'm basically going to go for spells, which means I'm going to need a lot of money. Which means maybe an hour of grinding, as long as I have the speed turned up and I'm very careful about which monsters I pick a fight with. But, um, 
yeah, I'm just going to do some grinding between this episode and the next, and we will see you guys in that next episode. Until then, everybody, have a good day. And thank you very much for watching, and look forward to the next episode and the next video of every, of every series that I've put up. Ever. Well, you know what I mean. Next, Look forward to the next one. Have a good day, guys.